Theresa May talking about growth rather than austerity, which makes a bit of a change for the government. Well, that's right, Charlotte. This is Theresa May's bid to reshape the British economy in a post-Brexit world. And it's a real move away from George Osborne's tack of tightening those purse strings. She also has a bit of a pop at the former Chancellor, talking about the need to create a proper strategy that will benefit everybody and not just the chosen few. That's becoming a bit of a mantra of Theresa May's. Now, it's significant that she will herself today chair that committee here behind me at Downing Street, gathering 11 of her cabinet ministers. And her officials tell me that that is because she is personally committed to boosting the British economy. Now, speaking ahead of that meeting, Mrs May said, we need a proper industrial strategy that focuses on improving productivity, rewarding hardworking people with higher wages and creating more opportunities for young people. If we are to take advantage of the opportunities presented by Brexit, we need to have our whole economy firing. Well, the details on this are still a little bit scarce, but what we do know is that with Labour in turmoil, if she gets this right, then the government can hope to attract some of those traditional Labour voters who used the referendum as a bit of a protest vote against feeling left behind.